let's calculate the integral we see on the screen. We have the integral of x minus 1 divided by the cube root of x squared minus 2x. Let's try if using the following formula t raised to n derivative of t equal to t raised to n plus 1 divided by n plus 1 plus c always that n is different from minus 1 and where c is from the set of real numbers. Let's try if using this formula we can solve this out. As we know on the denominator we have writing the denominator with as a fractionary exponent it would be the same as x squared minus 2x raised to 1 third the 3 is because of the square the cube root of course and now the denominator can be written with a negative exponent and there would there will be no exp no denominator at all so here we have x squared minus 2x raised to minus 1 third times x minus 1 times the numerator what we look for using this formula is finding the derivative of what's inside here the x squared minus 2x let's calculate the derivative of x squared minus 2x and that is 2x minus 2 what a pity we don't have it right here let's try to make some changes to find it so as we can see multiplying this x minus 1 by 2 we would obtain the 2x minus 2 and now we have to multiply it by 2 but also multiply the whole integral by 1 half so there's no changes at all let's write the rest of the integral and let's go with the 2 inside of this parenthesis let's multiply it so we have the relative of the power we can take the one half out of the integral and this would be equal to one half times the integral of x squared minus 2x raised to minus one third times the two times x minus one is two x minus two and now this would be equal to one half and applying the formula because we have a power and the derivative of the base of the power so with the formula we would have the base here x squared minus 2x raised to n plus 1 where n is minus 1 third so minus 1 third plus 1 divided by n plus 1 that is minus 1 third plus 1 plus c the constant this is equal to 1 half times minus 1 third plus 1 is 2 thirds and the numerator would be x squared minus 2x raised to 2 thirds plus the constant of course and this would be equal to 1 half and now this 2 thirds on the denominator the 3 can go up on the numerator so we would have 3 times let's transform the old numerator and let's write it with a, with a root that would be the cube root of x squared minus 2x square of course divided by 2 plus the constant and now we just have to multiply this one half times the other fraction so we will obtain the result that would be the same as 3 times the cube root of x squared minus 2x raised to 2 square and the denominator would be 2 times 2 4 plus the constant c and c is from the set of real numbers this would be the result of the given integral